gut health is such a hot topic these days, but apart from taking a probiotic, maybe eating some fermented foods, what are you supposed to do to actually cultivate an optimally healthy gut and work on healing the gut and building a healthy microbiome? I'll tell you what, you should be taking reishi mushroom, and I'll tell you exactly why in nine seconds. Hi, I'm Sage. It's great to be here with you. I'm your source of cutting edge wellness information to help you find answers and live a happier and healthier life. Please do me a favor and support us by hitting the subscribe button and ringing the notification bell. It just takes a moment of your time, doesn't cost you a single cent, and it does so much to support us as a tiny family business. And as you may know, I am deeply passionate about helping you on your health journey, not just with educational information, but also by offering some amazing products that I develop for our company. Down in the description, please find a link to our website with some of the world's healthiest gourmet chocolates, delicious elixir blends, and pure and potent adaptogens. I would love for you to try these. Now let's talk about reishi and how it's going to impact gut health. Now this is a study that was published in Nature Communications Journal, and they took two groups of mice, and they fed them an unhealthy high-fat diet. Uh, you know, probably lots of seed oil, soybean oil, vegetable oil, sunflower, safflower oil, all these kinds of things. Uh, and the mice who didn't take reishi actually gained 25% more weight. So this is not gonna, just taking reishi alone is not gonna totally mitigate the impacts of eating a horrible diet, but it is gonna quite substantially, uh, you know, not make it quite as bad for you, let's say. And so in these mice, reishi was shown to prevent development of fat tissue, inhibit gut inflammation, and inhibit buildup of harmful bacteria in the bloodstream. They also found that reishi was altering the bacterial ratio in the gut to create a healthier gut microbiome. So this is pretty interesting to see that reishi is having such a powerful impact all the way from the weight gain to the inflammation to the all the way down to the level of the gut microbiome itself and the healthy bacteria balance. But this wasn't enough for the researchers in this study. They had to take it a step further. How are they gonna take it a step further than that? They did a fecal transplant from the reishi mice to another mouse, because this is the way that you can confirm that it is the changes in the gut microbiome that are affecting the actual health and symptom changes seeing in the animal. So they took the poop from one mouse and they put it up, you know where, in another mouse, and they found the same reductions in obesity symptoms in that second mouse. So that is some wild research. It's not one that I personally would sign myself up for, but it's pretty awesome that we do know this now. And so with reishi, it is able to create such a powerful change in the microbiome that it can affect, you know, who knows how many other areas of your health. We know it's affecting the inflammation. And just think about how many different areas of your health are then impacted by your inflammation levels. So we'll have to add this to the growing and growing list of reasons to take reishi mushroom. You know, it does so much for your immune system, it does so much for stress relief, and it works on so many levels of health. It's modulating so many hundreds of micro functions in your body as one of the greatest adaptogens in the entire world. If you've tried reishi before, let me know in the comments what your experience has been like with it. And if you haven't tried reishi before, head over to our website. We have an amazing reishi mushroom extract that I would love for you to experience. And finally, before you go, over here is a video that we've uploaded recently that I think you would really enjoy. And over here on the other side, it's a video that the old YouTube algorithm thinks you would like to see. So hope you'll enjoy one of those, if not both of them, and have a beautiful day, guys. Look forward to seeing you again next time.